कंजर्वेशन ऑफ वाइल्ड लाइफ स्पीशीज species of animals fauna conservation of fauna so for the conservation of a <clears throat> wild species of animals those wild species whose population has a decreasing day by day earlier which were categorized under normal normal but due to the human factors their population reducing population reducing day by day so such fauna such animal species these are protected to the these are protected to the enactment of a wildlife protection act wildlife protection act protection act of 1972 1972 a large number of our animal species they are decreasing day by day decreasing day by day so such population such population protected by adopt a uh, by enactment of a law wildlife protection act wildlife protection act through which as a number of species of animals whose population as a decreasing their population protected so this act has been adopted by the all the states it governs that the wildlife conservation and protection wildlife conservation and protection of endangered species those species of animals which are reaching at the level of a extinction such number of species of animals endangered species are protected through the enactment of a wildlife protection act of 1972 <clears throat> this act prohibits the trade of rare and endangered categories trade of endangered species of animals as we discuss as a number of normal species which are present in our surroundings their killing is not as a illegal for example when we obtain as a leather leather from the animals this is not as the illegal activity such kind of industries are known as a pastoral based industries which obtaining their raw material from the animals raw materials from animals but except them the endangered species their trade is illegal in our country trade of endangered species of animals is illegal which is prohibited to the wildlife protection act wildlife protection act prohibits the killing of a endangered species of animals clear second demarcation of bio reserves demarcation of bio reserves bio reserves so bio reserves what are these places those places which are known for the which are known for the forest lands which are rich in a biodiversity which are rich in a flora and fauna such bio reserves their boundaries are marked demarcation means as there boundaries marked so under which as a three categories three types of the bio reserves are there bio reserves are there first national parks national parks national parks yes ashmit we just started as a conservation of a wildlife species sir could you please uh, explain sir could you please explain this yes ashmit wait sir could you explain this yes ashmit sir could you please explain this wildlife protection act protecting the those number of species of animals which are reaching at a level of a extinction means the endangered species they are killing their trade is a prohibited to the wildlife protection act of 1972 1972 second as a bio reserves government of india it demarcated it boundary uh, it marked as a boundaries of a those forest lands where where animals they can live at their natural habitats 
their natural habitats such as the bio reserves so in bio reserves as a first category as a national parks national parks is a national park is a reserved national park is a reserved area meant for preserving preserving natural vegetation ashmit your hand is still raised national parks is a reserved area reserved area meant for preserving natural vegetation natural vegetation and wildlife and wildlife at their natural habitats at their natural habitats at their natural habitats natural habitats means those demarcated areas protected areas where wildlife species of animals are living at their natural habitats they are rich in biodiversity where the animals are living at their natural habitats example in national parks human interference is allowed humans they can be as a move in a they can go tribes they can go for a agriculture they can collect as a fuel wood in a national parks but the killing is a prohibited killing prohibited examples example sariska in rajasthan sariska in rajasthan am i audible am i audible so sariska in rajasthan sariska which is known for a black buck we will discuss about it uh, sorry we will mark as their locations on a map at later sariska in rajasthan known for the home of a black buck second jim corbett jim corbett jim corbett in uttarakhand jim corbett in uttarakhand jim corbett in uttarakhand third simli pal simli pal simli pal Odisha, Simli Pal in Odisha, Raj Devra in West Bengal, Raj Devra, in West Bengal, Raj Devra in West Bengal. all these are examples of a uh, national parks periyar in kerala p e r i y a r periyar it is also a wildlife sanctuary periyar in kerala in kerala gir forest known for the asiatic lions in gujarat gir forest gujarat kanheri in a maharashtra k e n h e r i ame i'm again as repeating sariska in rajasthan jim corbett uttarakhand simli pal odisha raj devra west bengal periyar in kerala periyar in kerala gir in gujarat gir in gujarat kanheri in kanheri in maharashtra maharashtra dudwa 
दुधवा इन उत्तर प्रदेश दुधवा इन उत्तर प्रदेश and one more is there shivpuri shivpuri in madhya pradesh shivpuri in madhya pradesh all these are the examples of a national parks the sub category of a demarcation of a bio reserves i'm again as i repeating sariska in rajasthan jim corbett uttarakhand simlipal odisha rajdevra west bengal periyar keral gir gujarat kanheri in maharashtra दुधवा इन उत्तर प्रदेश एंड शेपुरी इन मध्य प्रदेश शेपुरी इन मध्य प्रदेश क्लियर क्लियर एनी क्वेश्चन टेल देर एनी क्वेश्चन सो दी ऑल दीज आर एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ अ नेशनल पार्क नेक्स्ट आर अ वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरीज वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरीज वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरीज wildlife centuries are wildlife centuries are wildlife centuries are s a n c t u a r i e s wildlife centuries are those protected lands those protected lands which are known for the endangered species which are known for the growth of endangered species endangered species of animals those protected lands which are known for growth of endangered species of animals endangered species of animals in such forest lands in such protected lands human interference not allowed these are the fully protected for a growth of a biodiversity growth of biodiversity human interference not allowed in a such protected lands in such protected lands human interference is not allowed some of the examples are there dachigam in jammu kashmir dachigam in jammu and kashmir rajaji in uttarakhand rajaji in uttarakhand kanha in madhya pradesh K A N H A, Kanha, in Madhya Pradesh. K A N H A, K A N H A, Kanha, in Madhya Pradesh. Kazi Ranga, Kazi Ranga, in Assam. Manas and Kazi Ranga. M A N E S and Kaziranga both are in Assam. Kaziranga K A Z I R A N G A Kaziranga Bandipur in Kerala. Bandipur in Kerala. bandipur in keral in keral and guindi g u i n d y g u i n d y it's in a tamil nadu it's in tamil nadu i'm again as repeating dachigam in jammu and kashmir raja ji in uttarakhand kanha in madhya pradesh manas in manas and kaziranga in assam bandipur keral bandipur keral and guindi in a tamil nadu 
in Tamil Nadu. G U I N D Y. Till there, any questions? These are the wildlife centuries. Next, as a category of a bird centuries. Bird centuries. Bird centuries. Bird centuries. So tell there any questions. Bird centuries. Bird centuries are those Kaziranga in Assam. It is also associated with the National Park and the Wildlife Century. This Kaziranga. Clear, dear? Next. Bird centuries. Those protected lands which are known for known for known for birds, especially the migratory birds. Migratory birds, they are coming towards the Indian subcontinent during the winters for breeding. For breeding. For breeding purposes, a large number of migratory birds like Siberian crane, Siberian crane, they are moving towards the they are moving towards the Indian subcontinent for breeding. The important areas are Periyar in Keral, P E R I Y A R, Periyar in Keral, Periyar in Keral, Bharatpur, B H A R A T P U O. P U R B H A R A T P U R in Rajasthan. Bharatpur in Rajasthan. Bharatpur in Rajasthan. Yes, Pragun. In, in Punjab, there is also a wildlife century. Its name is a Takni. T A K H N I. T A K H N I. It's in Husharpur. It's in Husharpur. If anyone of you wish to have, it's nearer to the town of Haryana. Haryana is one of the towns in Husharpur when we are moving towards as a the Sua sites. The Sua Mukeria site from Husharpur. On their way, there is a Haryana town. Through the Haryana, in Haryana, there is as a Takni. T A K H N I. T A K H N I. Takni is also as present in a Punjab. Ranthambore is known for the, this is as a wildlife century known for the home of a tigers. Ranthambore. You can also categorize under the wildlife centuries. Ranthambore. It's in a Ra Rajasthan. Clear? So, bird century is clear. Second point clear. The conservation of a wildlife species. First, as a Enactment of a Wildlife Prote Protection Act, 1972. Second, as a demarcation of a bioreserves. Now, third, demarcation of bioreserves. Now, third. Third, as a project tiger. Project tiger. Project tiger. Government of India. Government of India, Government of India initiated Project Tiger, initiated Project Tiger to protect population of tigers, especially in Sundarbans, in Sundarbans, West Bengal. Sundarbans, West Bengal, and Ranthambore, Rajasthan, Ranthambore, Rajasthan, Ranthambore, Rajasthan, Ranthambore, Rajasthan for its protection, for its protection, 
for its protection chatbir in chandigarh this is as the zoo it's not a wildlife sanctuary as a national park clear in a artificial conditions human uh, animals they are living in a such areas they are not living at their natural habitat to be nearer to the nearer to the chandigarh clear so second third as a project tiger fourth the wildlife action plan fourth conservation strategy opted by the government of india the national wildlife action plan national wildlife action plan it provides it provides the framework national action wildlife wildlife sorry na national wildlife action plan provides framework of strategy as well as program for conservation of wildlife conservation of wildlife it was initiated in 1983 this action plan launched in 1983 and it has been revised it has been revised in 2002 2002 2002 in which in which the protected areas for wildlife species protected areas for wildlife species increased till 99 national parks double nine national parks national parks and 513 513 wildlife sanctuaries wildlife sanctuaries demarcated in india wildlife sanctuaries demarcated in india clear fifth effort done by the government of india in relation to the protection of a wildlife species in relation to the wildlife species as special efforts special efforts are being special efforts are being made to preserve made to preserve endangered species endangered species through periodic census periodic census undertaken by undertaken by central government periodic census are undertaken by central government to know about the total existing population of animals existing population of animals existing population of animals sorry for uh so next sixth ban on a hunting and poaching government banned on a hunting and poaching illegal smuggling of a body parts of animals population of animals and the last one as a ban on hunting killing of a wildlife species of animals as banned by the government of india banned by government of india under which as if anybody kept the animal parts at their part uh, at their homes animal parts for example tiger skin horns of a uh, rhinos uh, tusk of elephant horns of barasinga or the skull of a deer such kind of the body parts of animals at their homes it will be as a consider as a illegal activity ban on a poaching illegal smuggling of a body parts of animals banned by the central government 
by the government of india but in china they are rearing a tigers for their skin in china they are rearing tigers for their skin they are uh, growing as a tigers when they become as a mature as a adult they are killed for their skin which has high demand in a world market in world market clear so these are the efforts the species of animals in india so any questions still there this was as the end of our chapter Na natural vegetation and wildlife resource natural vegetation and wildlife resource any questions next let's we do exercise yes skin just for the decoration purposes multiples of 7 raise your hands multiples of 7 raise your hands multiples of 7 raise your hands yes 7 14 21 21 raise your hands argun yes 14 roll number first question is here argun to which one of the following types of a vegetation does the rubber belong to argun singh 14 roll number in some kind of technical problem answer as a tropical evergreen tropical evergreen forest you can send your messages in a chat tropical evergreen yes ramneek and dia given as their correct answers ramneek and dia given their correct answers now the next one second question cinchona trees are found in the areas of rainfall more than more than 100 cm ramneek first answer dia second okay very good 100 cm wake up others send your messages in a chat aastha also given correct answer 100 cm third question in which of the following state is the simli pal located <coughs> simli pal bio reserve located in a odisha <coughs> so answers pragun ramneek purvi diya achita aastha very good next question question number 4 Hargun already give uh, Hargun West Bengal incorrect. Simply born in Odisha. Which one out of following bioreserves of India is not included in the world network of a bioreserves? World network of bioreserves. Yes, Manas correct. M A N A S. Manas is not categorized under the world network of the bioreserves. Ramneek's first answer. Then the Archita, Anushka, Hargun, and Astha. Manas M E N A S Manas in Assam not categorized under the World Heritage of a National Parks. Next, what factors are responsible for the distribution of a forest, which were which we discuss, which we discuss at the yes explain. It means as the last MCQ World Network of a Bio Reserves those areas those areas where as the the migratory birds they are not as approaching migratory birds are not approaching or not known for as a uh, protection of an endangered species so in that category manas it has associated for only for the rhinos in india manas known for the protection of a rhinos it has giving as a natural habitat wildlife sanctuary manas is an wildlife sanctuary okay factors affecting just only as a right there names no need no need to explain them factors affecting as a natural vegetation plants and animals are sunlight we are the more growth of the vegetation dense growth of vegetation animals are living in their diverse diverse form in such area sunlight soils sunlight soils weather conditions climatic conditions altitude altitude pandas only living in a cold weather conditions of a himalayan regions next as a what is a bio reserve and give two examples bio reserves are those protected areas those protected areas bio reserves are those protected lands protected lands bio reserves are previous answer correctly given by dia purvi and ramni and ramni Okay, next one. Question number two: 
bio reserves are those protected lands protected lands where where animals are living wildlife species of animals living at their natural habitats at their natural habitats at their natural habitats two examples any two examples either as a national park wildlife sanctuary as a bird sanctuary any one any two examples which we discussed as earlier sariska dachigam rajaji dudhwa jim corbett simlipal so many are there sundarban speriar kanha kanheri gir shivpuri any two examples so name two animals which having as a habitat in a tropical and a mountain type of vegetation mountain type of vegetation in a tropical conditions as monkeys and elephants monkeys elephants in a tropical conditions monkeys elephants tigers in a tropical conditions tropical conditions ashpreet ramnik and again ramnik yes two are given as a answer in a tropical conditions as a tigers elephants monkeys in a mountain vegetation as a snow leopard snow leopard himalayan panda himalayan panda snow leopard stag and yak given by dia clear so two their examples next flora and fauna distinguish in between of flora fauna and tropical and ever tropical and deciduous forest with their types with their animals with their species of with their species of trees and a with their species of trees and a particular weather conditions you have to attempt answer the questions briefly and a three long questions on your notebooks that's why tomorrow we will start as a poverty this is as the end of a geography portion now as a one chapter from economics remaining as a poverty four chapters are included in your march examination drainage climate natural vegetation and poverty 